EA Sports, and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. From historic Riviera Country Club and Pacific Palisades, we bring you opening round coverage of the Genesis Invitational. This promises to be a fun four days, a lot of storylines to get to as we check out the early leaderboard. Our leader is the former Georgia Bulldog, Keith Mitchell. He's rolling early at eight under par. Meanwhile, our featured golfer in good form coming into this one fresh off a victory a week ago. Ooh, and a tough start to the morning here. That one a bit wild and into some early trouble. That is so well done on in two on this opening hole. Frank had a good chance here for, at a minimum, a birdie to start the round. Not often you start on a par five and not often you reach the green in two or have an eagle putt. Hmm, that really could have paid off that previous shot, but the eagle, not to be. Not much to this one. It's for birdie. Okay, a well-played hole there. It is birdie to kick off the round. And he will very quickly move to one under par. That one going to be in great shape. So following the birdie at one, a solid drive here at the second. That is how it's done right there. What an approach shot. This is an 11 foot putt. Ooh, good speed there. That'll leave just a couple of feet. That finished off for par, you with the second, and he'll remain at one under par. That one looking a little right. And that will miss to the right, but fortunately it's pretty wide open over there. Walking the course today, let's bring in Nota Begay the third. Looking at 112 yards to the front, 117 to the hole, pin in the right front. That's a sand wedge, and it's right at it. Oh, that was a good strike. Took it straight at it, too, that one bounce and check. Well played. Okay, nicely done. That's in for birdie here at three.
And that one not on the green, but not in a terrible spot either. Sitting up in the short grass. Well, those are the shots that turn what you'd like to be a leisurely stroll out on the golf course into a day of hard work. Yeah, what could have been a tap-in is now going to be a grind. That's him. It is a good par here at number four. And he'll stay at two under. That is not where you want to be. That's up on the hill right of this fifth fairway. Working out of the rough now for his second at the par four fifth. Oh, that was a good strike. I could tell that by the uh, sound as the ball came off the club face. That little bounce and check. Well done. Yes, a good read. It's a birdie here at five. So that one off target, knocked down a bit by that tree, and that'll make things difficult from there. Had to take the boxing gloves off on that one. No touch whatsoever, and this is a long, long putt coming back. Okay, it's a bogey here at number six. And that's going to drop him to two under. All right, in the fairway. Now, note to his second from the fairway. 141 yards left to the hole, looking to make up for that drop shot with a birdie here. Ah, uh, good shot. Safely on the green and a birdie chance. Ah, yes, runs that one right in. It's a birdie here at the seven.
Uh, it all looks so simple when you're going good, doesn't it? And that is yet another solid drive. Kane cut back left here today as he stares down his second to the par four. Touch long, a touch lift. But still, how good can he putt? 11 feet away. Mm, hang on. That's going to leave about three feet. Okay, that in four par here at the eight. And he'll stay at minus three. <laughs> that is gonna wind up right down Broadway. A majestic looking tee shot there from the fairway. Let's go to Noda. Beautiful look at the ninth with the clubhouse in the background, but players beware, severely uphill. Whatever club you select, add one more. And a good iron shot, just not quite as close as what we'd all want to finish, but still. Birdie putt coming up, and we go to Iona Steven. Yeah, we've got two things to contend with here. First, it'll be fast back down the hill, but also this is going to be working its way from left to right. Nah, that was low from the start. Okay, good putt there for his par here at the ninth. And that is going to finish off a three under front side as they go out in 32. Boy, a good round going here on this Thursday, and that another fine effort off the tee. Good chance to get one in close from here. This is second. Looking to splash this softly onto the green. Never mind the up and down. That is a different kind of up and down. Up, out of the bunker, and down into the hole. So that ball nestles down in the rough. Just got away a little bit on that tee ball. Oh, 
has to be thrilled with that second shot here to the par five. Frank got everything out of that. Yeah, it did well just to advance the ball so far down the fairway. And now a fairly straightforward third shot. Well, at least he can draw on the experience from the previous hole, again in the bunker. Boy, that needed to hit the flag stick. It nearly went in the hole, but instead, it runs out quite a ways. Oh, that'll bring a rise smile. A very good putt there to save his par. And he'll remain at four under. Somehow, the ball's got through the other side of the tree and really hadn't lost that much yardage. What a nice shot, right on the green, and a pretty easy putt on the way. Okay, that'll help the cause. It's a birdie here at number 12. And he moves to five under now, three back of our leader. Problems there. That's going to wind up safely in the fairway. From the fairway, Nota, this is second. 148 yards left to the hole. Coming off a birdie at the previous hole, looking to go back to back. A little further right, a little further up. That would have been close. Well judged, that is in for par here at 13. And he'll stay at five under. All right, you take those all day long. On the green, chance for birdie coming up. Mm, 
got it there, but not quite on target. No issues there. It is a par here at 14. And he'll remain right where he is. Definitely there today. Another wonderful tee shot. A second shot looming here from right around 165 yards. And safely on deck. That's the main thing, but from that distance, really don't want to leave yourself like a knee knocker, like a four or five footer. So this first putt's going to have to be good. Not that time. Pretty good effort, but it'll wander a couple of feet by. Okay, a solid par here at the 15th. And he'll stay right where he is. Okay, that ball safely on the green. Now this for another birdie. A great deal of success on the greens thus far, but this one's going to be a challenge. Nah, that might have been a little more break than he was expecting as that one winds up undercutting the hole. Okay, that'll be a par here at 16. And he'll remain right where he is. Well, you can't walk out and drop it any better than that. That is a fine tee shot right there. Still better than three bills away as he puts forth his second to the par five. shot on him too on this part five but work's not done yet uh, i'm a tough task master if he makes the part or at least gets down and two then i'm going to congratulate him on this hole yeah that's really well done from that distance you'll take it every time Pushed it. Mm, that's a tough one to miss. No problems there. That's a par. 
here at 17. And he'll stay right where he is. He just keeps motoring right along. Another good tee shot right there. From the fairway, we check in with Noda. Tough not to get distracted with the majestic amphitheater setting here at the 18th at Riviera, but be mindful, you must land the ball left of the hole to get it close. be fairly pleased with that Frank what do you think I certainly do it was so so good okay safely in for his par at 18 our featured golfer in a good position you'd have to say just three shots off the pace after round one just got to keep the leaders in check though can't afford to get uh, well further away till next time for our entire cast and crew I'm Rich Lerner this has been a presentation of EA Sports PGA Tour Golf. So long, everybody.